The Crawford Forum's emerging as probably the most serious policy dialogue in the country now. We bring together 150 of the best and the brightest, 50 from the business sector, 50 from the research and advocacy community, and 50 from the public sector, including the politicians. And the object is, along with a stellar cast of international speakers, to really get people engaged on the great geopolitical, economic, economic and social issues um, that Australian policymakers are going to have to confront. I'm here at the Crawford Forum to talk about the prospects for the world economy at what is really a critical juncture. We are, have big questions about the sort of recovery we're going to get in the developed world. We're very much concerned about the Eurozone and its future, but I think an even bigger question is what's going on in emerging countries. And at the centre of that is the future of China. And once we start thinking about these things, we also start thinking about the whole global economic and political order which is being changed in front of our eyes. I'm really excited to be here talking about the impact of how technology and digitization in particular is going to disrupt but the traditional industries, at the same time also create significant opportunities. It's critically important as a CEO to actually be able to stand back and not just think of the bigger picture issues in your industry, but the bigger picture issues in the world, because if you don't know the context in which you're operating, you really can't do your job. Australia doesn't have enough of this, and the ANU, which is Australia's preeminent research university in many ways, has this huge capability of pulling together the A crowd in this space. So we're all here, we all want to participate, we all want to contribute. So I think it's going to be a terrific couple of days.